Okay, guys, we're ready to get this one underway. Given who the champ's in the ring with tonight, I wouldn't be at all surprised if we witnessed history here. As we get started, I should mention that the challenger comes into this match with a great deal of momentum. I can't wait to see his plan of attack. What do you expect from him? He really isn't used to being an underdog, but that's exactly what he is right now. Let's see if he can take the title from the champ. I gotta agree with you, and I know that. Win or lose, he's a superstar we're going to hear a lot from. The champ's starting to stumble a bit. He's a true champion. I suspect he has plenty of fight left in him. The dangers of this triple threat match appear to have escalated quickly on him. And this has all the makings of getting out of hand fast. He better be careful. Brock Lesnar going to work now. If there's a finishing move that can end an opponent's existence once and for all, it's the F5 from the Beast Incarnate. The move shows Lesnar's power and true disdain for humanity. This can go a variety of different ways, Corey. And almost none of them are good. The DDT, how's that mat taste? Challenger starting to falter. So much on the line here in the match for him. But it's still a little too early to get overly concerned here. If you ask me, they both seem pretty even as far as health is concerned. The most incredible thing about Brock Lesnar's F5 is no matter who it is, the Conqueror lifts up his adversary with the greatest of ease. No one can stop this man. The list of WWE Hall of Famers, legends, superstars, heck, even executives who have been destroyed by the F5 is too long to mention. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. Kane making a statement as we speak. No, he reverses it. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Brock Lesnar sent shockwaves through WWE like never before when he debuted on SmackDown in 2002. Lesnar became the youngest WWE Champion in history when he beat The Rock at SummerSlam that year. Looking at it here, and he's heading back in. Didn't have to dig very deep to kick out of that one. Just needs to do more damage. Taken down with a beautiful suplex. See what kind of response we'll get. An emphatic finisher. He's really looking to prove a point here. Brock Lesnar's just getting overwhelmed. The Beast Incarnate put the sports entertainment world on notice when he returned to WWE in 2012. And the fate of the choke slam straight to hell. I can't believe it, Michael. He lands the overhand. Made him pay there. Ain't no stopping him now. The way I see it, this might be German after German by Brock. He's back in control here. You're going to want to see your internist after a slam like that. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Is that it? 
Is it over? Gets the shoulder up. And the match continues. Looks like trouble here, Byron. I don't know. I guess that all depends on who you're rooting for. A sickening thud. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big... Here's the pin. Title on the line. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Strowman is taking no prisoners right here. Strowman... This is not going to be good at all. Oh, Braun Strowman slamming into the mat. But can Strowman follow up here? That is exactly what Braun Strowman needed. Quickly into the cover with a title on the line. Nice job by Brock Lesnar there. The great ones always explode when they have the chance. The unfortunate reality is he might not get up, which wouldn't shock me one bit. Talk about a beating he's taken here tonight. Super City! Man, looked like the champ was down and out for a moment there, but not anymore. Shoulders down, championship on the line, and he barely avoids the pinfall. Wow, Kane is in bad shape, but he powers out nonetheless. That's how champions battle. Kane showing some expert prowess here. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. Here's the pin, title on the line. He's still in it, I can't believe it. Wow, I am impressed. He's a spinning ball of energy. Check out Braun Strowman's offense. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. Brock Lesnar is down, but he ain't out yet. Powered through to survive there. Check out Braun Strowman's offense. There's the pan. Ken is a point kick out. Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. I've seen countless triple threat matches over the years, and I can confidently say that this one ranks right up there with some of the all-time best. Brock is definitely enjoying himself right here. Now we have Kane on the attack. You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike. And that nailed it with such authority. History might be made here. Will this be it? Two! Action we're seeing here at the Royal Rumble.